welcome guys to Djavinci TV and if you are new to this channel guys please kindly consider subscribing liking sharing and uh, if you have got an issue just leave it in the comment section below now how uh, today you want to talk about an issue that has been going online about two songs that has got the same title and the songs were produced by two uh, different artists but now the song coincident that coincidentally has got two same title now this is just after Eli Toto he said to release a new song titled Gema Emadung so the Gema Emadung song will be released on 24th July on Saturday that is the Gema Emadung by Eli Toto and on this day Ferija Kadongo will be a guest artist here and now and coincidentally Bruce Zinda the Winandare himself also and Musa Jakarela the Joyman also are set to release a new release Gema Emadung and now the, the same song will be produced the same the song with the same title it is not the same song it's just the song with the same title will be produced in most of the official page on friday at 17.00 hours so let us just clarify what was happening here according to Presinda. and finally ladies and gentlemen the brothers has brought us together to give you a joint product it is the death affair joyman and jonabi collabo Official shall be dropping on Friday on YouTube Musa Jakadal official. The link is below. Elito also posted that on 24th July this month, game Emma Duong will be released officially in my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel account. The link here is below. So during this time, Elito will be releasing the song. There will be a live event. And that one will, will be attended with a guest artist, Rodija Kadogo himself. So the songs are having the same title, but actually they are different. So this is according to Wolfie B on his Facebook page when he came clear and stated that the two songs are not manipulated in any way or are not there to confuse fans or are in any way related, but they are really different. So let me read what Wolfie B wrote. This is just a coincidence. Game Emma Duong by Musa Jakarala music featuring Prince Inda and that done by Elisha Mdodawa Shule Prophet are actually two different songs with the different storylines. Now this week we support the Jays eat one million of it in one day. Then on 24th we support Eli Toto. The interest is growing. That is what we want. Let not say things that will intoxicate the good work our artists are doing. This is just like two men giving birth and ends up naming their kid the same name. I flew to Nairobi yesterday and I met Musa Jakadala and Alicia Toto later in the evening. Alicia Toto met with Peace Omudo and they had chat over the same. I have listened to the both songs and they are big hits. It is well, let's show them love and support Ajawa to the world. He also further added that Eli Toto has not collaborated with Fredija Kadongo. He has just invited him to support him on that day as a guest artist when he will be having to release the new song Ajawa Republic. Now, another thing about these two songs, about the two songs, is that one song probably this one is produced by Kiwa Studio, and then this other song is produced by the Melo Music Empire. So, I mean, even the producers are different. But the songs are also different. It is only that the title is the same. That's what we will be saying. And according to those who have heard this, there are also other speculation that perhaps they were trying to confuse fans. But according to both sides, it is like it is like a coincidence. Now let's wait and guys, let's support these guys, support them. Subscribe to more than of shows, subscribe to Prestinda's channel, let's subscribe to Elijah's channel. Jakadongo is also a very good man. Let's support these guys there. Now thank you guys for watching the JVC TV at this time. Guys now if you are new to my channel kindly consider liking, subscribing and comment leave your comment in the section below you are also free to share my videos with your friends thank you see you in the next video i love you